She said this in an interview after the tragic fire incident and the loss of her mother. When everything you have been accustomed to having has been taken away, you realize what life is, not because what you continue with is what life gives you. I will rebuild my life day by day. I have truly surrendered it to God. And yung, yung pagkakasabi mo nun, I think when you're at a time of tragedy, parang it's ano, talagang you give it all up. Eh. It's actually grace. Yeah? It's and grace, true. You, reali you realize the truth of what you do not need in life. You don't have to doubt that we really don't need much. But you have to realize that when we are at the point, the lowest point, mm -hmm. those are the words that you can easily say, but that's the hardest, hardest to, to actually believe, believe that's in. That's why it's diba? a grace, because then you re you're, you're really pushed to so uh, a, a real situation that tells you, hey, it is a truth. You can actually, actually live that truth from now on. You can trust that if you strip down, if you just really live according to what is enough, you know, instead of having and wanting to have more, but focusing more on what you are born to give, then that is really enough. I mean, when I saw the house, it was talagang natupok siya sa, to, to ashes. How humbling was that moment? Humbling, more than humbling. It was a celebration of uh, God in my life. God is everything in my life from taking and it was not just the fire it was because being with, accompanying my mother when she was sick and in a debilitating disease and talagang seeing grace day by day and being grateful for life for life in her eyes for for everything that we share together as souls for each other on and, earth and we know that just recently you lost your mom right after well, 23 days after the fire she passed away and not how just did you cope? Up. How did you cope? Because I can imagine, you know, you must not have any other things, right? 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 You must not have any other things, I had no time to recover because God kept me covered every step of the way in our life together and especially in the last few years of taking care and accompanying her during those very dark times of her life because she had to bear the talagang the illness no she had to bear the sickness the illness and of course being stripped away from friends from from the world from everything and everyone 